Hello, everyone. Welcome to my The Young and the Restless Homies official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. The Young and the Restless spoiler suggests that Abby Newman Abbott recently joked about attending her own wedding. In soap operas, they prefer to use reverse clues. So could this mean that anything occurs to Abby on her wedding day to Dave on Hamilton Winters? Will Chance Chancellor save the day and reunite his past romance? The Young and the Restless Spoilers Abby Newman Abbott's Wedding According to YNR Spoilers, Dagon proposed to Abby, who gladly accepted. Abby was afraid to tell Ashley Abbott about the news over video chat at first. Abby was concerned that her wedding to Davon would be disastrous. Ashley reassured Abby, which seemed to resolve the situation. Could Abby's gut have been telling her something? All in our spoilers, Ashley Abbott returns. Abby and Davon haven't had an easy time organizing their wedding. Another clue that the soap wedding could be doomed. Abby refused to marry until her mother could be present. Ashley is still at a Paris treatment center for dissociative identity disorder. However, it was recently announced that Ashley would be released just in time for Abby's wedding. If Abby did not appear to have reconciled with her mother, there would be cause for concern. Even if Abby hesitated, she would not pass up the opportunity to reunite with her mother. The Young and the Restless Spoilers Victor Newman's Secret Location According to the Young and the Restless Spoilers, Abby also struggled with her wedding dress. It wasn't the one Abby expected, so she requested Sally Spectra to create a new one for her. Also, Abby and Davon's planned venue did not work out. Abby and Davon were unable to modify their wedding date, but Victor Newman came to the rescue. The wedding will most likely take place at the recently restored Newman Ranch. Victor is revealing the gorgeous restoration just in time for Nikki Newman's anniversary. So it would be just like Victor to have Abby's wedding at the same location. I and our spoilers, Chance Chancellor's rescue. Given all of the problems with the wedding and Abby's reservations, one would suppose that cold feet may explain her absence. However, Abby would not miss the opportunity to reunite with Ashley. Jordan has also been missing for some time. Jordan appears overdue for an escape, and what better spot than the newly rebuilt Newman Ranch? Could Jordan have been behind Abby's wedding kidnapping? Will Chance end up protecting Abby and keeping her from marrying Davon? Even though Chance is now seeing Summer Newman, they have a fight next week. It also appears that Summer is returning to Kyle Abbott. If this happens, Chance and Abby may have a second chance. The Young and the Restless. Spoilers and updates. Nate Hastings enlists an unexpected companion to help him discover Damien, his younger half-brother. Will the mustache, Victor Newman, be willing to assist him after all this time on the outside? The Young and the Restless. Spoilers. Amy Lewis needs results. And quickly, Amy Lewis is about to rendezvous with Nate hoping for positive news. She poured her heart into her request, pleading with Nate to find his half-brother, Damien, before it was too late, with a grave diagnosis hovering over her, every moment counted. If Nate rejects Amy's plea, the plot loses momentum, increasing the likelihood that he will start on an urgent search. While Nate could agree to help find Damien, the absence of leads will be a huge barrier. Locating Damien will need significant resources in the next weeks or months, so Nate may find himself working with an unexpected ally in this inquiry. I and our spoilers. Nate Hastings and Victor Newman had a falling out in the past. Viewers are fully aware of the tension that erupted when Nate was fired from Newman Enterprises. Victor wasn't always fond of Nate, but there was a moment when he looked up to him and relied on him as a doctor. Furthermore, Victor cherishes family ties, which may make him willing to assist Nate in his search for his half-brother. He once had to track down an amnesiac, Adam Newman. 
Nate might pay a visit to Victor's office, explain his convoluted predicament, and see if the mustache can help. Victor may admire Nate for his courage in approaching him and respectfully demanding the assistance he requires. There's a chance he'll step up for Nate when it really counts. The young and the restless spoilers. Nate Hastings may talk to other friendlier Newmans first. It's probable that Nate may first contact Victoria Newman or Abby Newman Abbott. Any of them could persuade Victor to listen to his worries. Regardless matter the strategy, Victor has a vast network of people ready to help him locate Damien swiftly. Nate cannot just walk from door to door looking for clues. He must have a more strategic method if he is to bring Damien back to Amy before time runs out. This could pave the way for a brotherly bond between Nate and Damien. But finding Damien is the most important first step in this difficult quest. And Victor is the one to go to if you need to find Damien quickly. According to the young and the restless spoilers, Sharon Newman continues to lie about her role in Heather Stevens' death. Heather has resolved to make Sharon pay and to haunt her until she does. Will Heather's spirit end up leading Sharon to have an accident? The young and the restless spoilers. Sharon Newman has lost her mind. The young and the restless spoiler suggests that Sharon is in far worse need of assistance than some know. Sharon has Nick Newman as her conscience and Heather urging her to do the right thing now that Cameron Kirsten has left her. Unfortunately, things could have gone horribly wrong on Halloween, and they still might. Sharon is driving distracted while seeing a ghost in her vehicle. Sharon might have hit anyone, including a child, during Halloween activities without even realizing it. Sharon does not need to be driving with all of the voices in her head because of the risk it poses to others. When is this going to stop? Why and our spoilers, Phyllis Summers is gaslighting Sharon Newman. Except for Heather, Phyllis is the only person who knows Sharon is responsible for this crime and is working to bring her to justice. If Phyllis continues, as Heather haunts Sharon, things might get a lot worse. Sharon has already threatened to obtain a restraining order against Phyllis, which might place her in great danger. Sharon's mentality is both deceitful and unstable, particularly with regard to Phyllis and Daniel Romilotti. Sharon will not hesitate to use this restraining order to remove Phyllis or Daniel if it prevents the truth from getting out. Sharon's primary goal is to permanently silence Phyllis. The young and the restless spoilers the truth needs to come out. Daniel was compelled to send his daughter on tour with her grandfather to keep her out of harm's way. Unfortunately, this does not make Daniel feel any better because he is unable to tell Lucy Romilotti what she needs to hear right now. Lucy needs to know that her father will be there for her, and he cannot guarantee that. Could Sharon have intentionally hit Daniel or Phyllis with her car to get them out of the way? Sharon has already informed Nick that if Phyllis continues to torment her, she will be forced to take action. Does Sharon need Heather's ghost to motivate her to harm her next victim? Could Sharon just pretend to notice something and run down Phyllis? So what do you guys think about this update? Let me know in the comments below. If you like my videos, please like and subscribe for more information. I'll see you guys next time.